Hi guys. So before we jump right into the video, I'd like to shout out to this sponsor, which is Better Me. Now I've worked with Better Me before on my channel. If you've seen my 9 a.m weekend morning routine then you know better me okay better me is a wellness company they specialize in accessible digital products for pretty much everyone so it doesn't matter your age it doesn't matter your physical capability as long as you're trying to hit a fitness goal or a health goal this is a company for you they have two apps they have the health coaching app and they also have the mental health app which is the one that i religiously use so i'll definitely recommend that you go and watch that video i'll link it in the description box below so you guys can watch that and know what i use the mental health app for they just launched their store and the store is pretty much where you could buy like you know sportswear for any type of activity sports activity anyway and that's pretty much going to be linked as well in the description box below they sent over their latest addition to the company which is their new year's resolution kit is their new year's 2023 let me put it like this 2023 resolution box i received this like a few days ago i've been dying to open it i didn't have a paper it a little bit but I wanted to unbox it on camera for you guys. So this is how the box comes. So pretty. If you have a health and fitness goal on your list for the year 2023, I definitely recommend that you check out this box to just kickstart your journey if that makes sense. This is a box that I think would be a really good gift for anyone because this is you trying to push them to do better with their health, you know, this year, right? So you can gift it to your friends, your family, your loved ones, pretty much anyone. But anyway, let's go ahead and open the box. It looks like this really nice it has confetti i just don't want it to get everywhere but it's cute in the box right the top says this part of the box says this year we revamped the tradition of gift gift given experience drives changes day by day definitely does so this is like i said a really good gift for anyone the first thing i'm picking up is their better me band it's a health and fitness tracker everyone needs this and it's compatible with android and ios i have one that was given to me by my company like I think a few months ago but that one was was all right this one looks really good like it looks i'm going to just open it and see oh yeah this is nice i definitely would i would use the hell out of this the heck out of this i love it i love it okay so the next thing i'm picking up i'm just not trying to get the confetti everywhere let's see I love this cute bags, like this mini bags. It could definitely be used to like store stuff. These are resistant bands. So I think these are short ones because they look short. Or maybe these are the long ones. So yeah, these are the long ones. So I think these ones are the stretch and recover long resistant bands. That's what it's called. And then I have another one. Same bag. These bags are really cute. Oh, these are glute resistant bands. Nice. Inside the box also comes this card. The front of the card says, let's start your journey with a band, at leisure, and a better me app. The back says, make your set special. Customize your brow with an inspired message of your, of your choice just by scanning this QR code. So basically, what this means is, they usually have like their sets, which you guys have seen. I have have like a couple that i've showed you guys before like i said i'm going to link that video in the description box below what's so cool is that you can customize those bras so you can put anything anything that you like to write on your bra for free you could write on your bra i wrote empowered queen i think that's what mine says i'm going to leave it on the screen so you guys can see the two last exciting things about this box is number one the lifetime um subscription premium subscription to the health coaching app the second thing is that you also get a 50 to 100 dollars gift card that you could use to shop on the store you could buy anything with a hundred dollars 50 to 100 dollars basically i think the box comes with two options one which is pretty much 99 dollars another one is 149 dollars so just depending on your denomination you can order this box from their website i'm going to link in the description box below it is free shipping so you don't have to worry about paying for shipping and all that kind of stuff i definitely recommend that you try them out you know start your health and fitness journey with better me you can never go wrong the mental health app will save your life for stress for anxiety for sleep oh my god because it helped me a lot when i was struggling with sleep last year definitely recommend better me if you have any health and fitness goal and you don't know where to start 
better me is where you should start okay like i said everything is going to be linked in the description box below go ahead and click away shop away and start your fitness and health journey okay now that we have that out of the way let's get right into the video I don't know who sent this little thing to me. I'm just going to tell you you're wrong, okay? You are so wrong. I will rock this thing and I'll make it look cute. And in a few days, it will have no choice than to leave. I'm telling you. <laughs> but hey, guys, I don't think I actually introduced this vlog. But welcome to a new vlog. Welcome to a new, you know, era in my life. Happy New Year. Oh, my God. Yes. Happy New Year. Yes. Oh, we are in 2023 and we're flawless and it's going to be an amazing year for all of us okay oh thank you also you guys for watching my last vlog not my last video but my last vlog you guys really liked it and i didn't really expect it because you guys don't really watch my vlogs let's be honest but if you want me to keep vlogging i will keep vlogging and it's a new year so new things <laughs> So I'll keep talking. Just let me know in the comment section below if you want like a weekly vlog. But not daily for sure because obviously I work in 9 to 5. You guys know that. So there's absolutely no way I'm going to have a camera in my face every single day. It's not realistic. But weekly vlogs I can do. So if you want to see that, let me know in the comment section below. But yeah, I'm not starting this vlog in the morning. I know in the last clip you guys saw I was... I brush my teeth wash my face all that kind of stuff i do need to you know put chapstick on or something because my lips are crusty but i'm working on morning that's the reason why i didn't have the time to kind of stand up and do things like my morning routine on time it's been uh, one hell of a morning i'm starting this vlog i think it's like one past one almost 2 p.m i'm going to drop you guys here because i can't pull this camera is this better I think this is better oh yeah this is way way better but yeah um i made oxtail yesterday for the first time and no one told me i didn't look up the a recipe for oxtail because when i'm making something new i typically especially if it's meat i just want to make it the way that i feel like it would be good for me you know i kind of wing it and do my own thing i should have looked up ox oxtail because honey this thing took forever to cook so if you have like alternatives or recommendations or whatever that i could use to you know shorten the cooking time of this oxtail just let me know because it tasted so good when it finally when it was finally done but it took so long i had dinner really late which i don't like that It's such a gloomy weather today because it is raining. It's been raining like all day. I need to do some work. Some work work. Whoa. I need to sit down and do more work. I'm just going to take some time and, you know, do some office work and also some youtube work because before this video i'm pretty sure you guys saw the um sponsored content from better me which again i'll definitely recommend that you guys try it like there are different things that i recommend to you guys on my channel but you see better me i love it so much i love the app and before they even started working with me I was using their products like religiously so that's the reason why 
I'm actually um, recommending them. I'm trying to edit the content because I need to send it out. So that's the major thing. Is this tomorrow? Yeah, 6th of January. I need to edit because I'm supposed to do a reel for them. I'm supposed to do a story post and I'm also supposed to do like a video integration. Into integration. So I'm trying to, I've done all of them this morning. I have to step out like in a few hours. So I need to try my best to edit all of this like right now, like before I leave the house so that I can send it over to the, to the company for approval. I just got dressed. Well, took a shower and then I got dressed and I'm about to spray my fragrance for the day so i decided to show you guys i will be spraying or i'm going to spray the billy eilish eilish listen you guys when i first heard about this fragrance i smelt it in the store and i didn't like it because i couldn't smell anything then i let it be for like a few months i would say I smelt it again at my friend's shelf. Oh my god, this bothers me so much. But I already told you guys I'll rock it. So I smelt it in my friend's shelf in a house. So I, I could smell it in a house. But this is a really sweet, calm, warm fragrance. It is packed with vanilla. In fact, the opening is vanilla. The first whiff you get when you spray this is vanilla. This is perfect for like cozy weathers. And like I told you guys earlier, it is raining, like pouring. Well, now it has stopped. In Budapest, let me just drop you guys down because I don't like holding this for so long. But yeah, it's pouring in Budapest. The weather is just calm and like cozy. It's like those hot chocolate type of weather. So this is definitely the fragrance for the season. Oh, so good. I really love it. They have the 2.0 and I think that will lean more masculine because it's in a black bottle. This bottle is so beautiful, by the way. Even when I finish it, I'm going to just leave it on my shelf because... Oh my god, you guys, and I'm going to mix it with this fragrance. This is, I think, the latest Zara. Oh, I can't speak. The latest Zara release. It's their Captivating Memories like collection. I picked this up also like a few days ago, and you guys, this is so lovely. It is a coffee fragrance. I think it has coffee because that's the first thing I smelled when I when I sprayed this. It has coffee. It has milk. I shall know it has something that is so creamy and like cozy. So mixing the both of them is just like having a vanilla coffee or like a cappuccino on you. Like that's what it smells like. I really love it. So you guys buy this. Oh, guys, the most annoying thing just happened to me. I have this app that you could pretty much rent a car as you go each day. I don't know if it makes sense. So basically, the same way you call a taxi, but you're the one driving the taxi and you have your card attached to the app. It's called Moly Moly. If you're in Hungary, you know that. And I'm sure they have those like car services like in other places. I was so sure that's what I was going to be using to run all my errands. So I, I'm not dressed properly. I shows you the cars that are around you and so so the one that was close to me was like about three three four minutes why is this guy so loud um it was three four minutes i got there and the app jammed like it just stopped working so now i had to take a bus because my first stop is actually dhl i want to drop off my passport for the um i want to send it to serbia for the uk um embassy and stuff because oh shit <laughs> because i got granted the visa like i had to renew my visa so i did it like a week ago or two a week and a half it's not even up to two weeks it was pretty much like a few days before christmas that's when i renewed my stuff and it got approved so i had to send off my passport i should have just dropped the passport to be honest because i thought it was going to take like three weeks but it took less so anyway, my first stop is DHL. I have to ship off my passport to Serbia so they could put in the um, the visa, right? But I am so cold because I'm not properly dressed. I'm not properly dressed for this because I thought I was just going to be driving. But apparently I'm not. Oh my God, I want to cry. I'm freezing, but I'm here though. So let me just do this. <laughs> Hello. Hi. 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 Hi
Hi. Um, sorry, I'm just going to drop this here. I want to send off my passport to Serbia for the, for the TLS. TLS, yes, for TLS. Okay. Do you know this one? Yes. So the receivers are due Okay, okay. Okay, okay, thank you. That's good. Oh my god, you guys, I am so mad. I can't believe the app didn't work. Like, it just stopped working. I tried it for like a few minutes, but obviously, I can't spend a lot of time because I have other things to do. So, I had to use the bus. I'm so annoyed because i'm not properly dressed i'm so cold so i feel like today my nose is already running oh god i literally just finished with them and oh my god okay <laughs> i have another package from dhl that i'm trying to return i got something from farfetch and i didn't like it okay so the color was just kind of different so i have to return it and i hate returning things the courier guy came yesterday to take it but i wasn't home he came today and then he said i didn't print out this label she said she could help me if i just brought the package but i didn't think about it i'm just going to have to wait for him to what's the word to come tomorrow and stuff but she helped me print it so which is nice wait why does this seem like it's zoomed out yeah it is i just got home and i've decided to go back to dhl so i just have to quickly change something not change but i just want to wear something on top of this so i'm just going to wear this sweater on top of what i have on right now they close at six and it's five so i have to be real quick it's not far from my house and that's the only reason why i can do this because i could have just waited to tomorrow but i don't trust the timing i don't trust the timing because i need a refund on the item and I don't know how long it will take farfetch so I just don't want to jinx it because I want my money back. This thing was expensive, okay? It was so expensive. I can't miss on it, so I'll just put the stuff here. I think like this. I think this is how she asked me to do it. So I'll just do it like uh here. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So nothing else, right? Okay. Thank you so much. You guys, this is the reason why I wanted to get the um, the car because it took me about like thirty minutes to get here. It's rush hour. So bye. Thank you. Have a great day. It's rush hour in Budapest at the moment. So I already knew that at this time I'll be out doing stuff. So I wanted to get the car, right? It took me a long time. Honestly, I'm so pissed, but I'm glad that I was able to drop the package off. I just did. And now I think I have some time to kill because I have my nail appointment at 6 30 so i have a lot of time actually to kill <sighs> oh my god i just honestly that hassle that i did just now pissed me off but i met a lovely girl in the dhl office um i can't remember her name right now but shout out to you girl because she was really sweet to me <sighs> so anyway um i'm just going to <gasps> that is so pretty okay should i really go this way do y'all see that? No matter how many times I see this in a year, it'll forever be beautiful to me. I don't think camera even does it justice. It's so pretty to me. I don't think it stays here all year, but I think towards the end of the year is when they put it. But it'll always be pretty to me. I think I've seen this like a million times. I mean, I've been in Hungary for like eight years. <laughs> so. I have seen this a lot, but still, it's always so pretty to me. Same goes for the fashion street. Every time I'm here, I always want to take a video. 
because that's how pretty it is to me every single time I'm going into H&M this is pretty much the biggest H&M we have in Hungary as a whole not just Bud not just Budapest sometimes I don't know if it's the cold I just get stuck but yeah I am here to look for my favorite leggings okay I have to shout I have to look for my favorite leggings it's pretty much the only leggings I wear my friend Fatim hooked me up to this leggings and I have been stuck for a year now well is it even up to a year but yeah I've been stuck to it I have I think two or three so now I just have to they keep changing the position of their stuff every day these people are actually hard workers if I'm being honest now I have to walk around the store to look for it ah uh, Oh God, if we don't have it, I'm going to be so sad because the last time I looked for it, which was like a week ago, didn't have it. So, I have to keep trying. Like. Oh, I'm currently waiting for my taxi. Oh, I think this is it. Uh, yeah. Hello. Yeah, Lucy. Yes. Oh. Diak. Uh -huh. uh -huh. And it's a mess because of the the sales. Mm. Uh, for the nails. Yeah. Um, I want I want it short first, but it's still gonna be French, but short. So I just got to my nail appointment. I'm a bit exhausted and I think it's because of the weather actually. But yeah, I'm about to get my nails done. But both my hands and my toes. And I've been obsessed with French lately. So I think my last three, four, five nail design has been French. And I'm a stick beside it. It's just elegant and classy. So I guess that's why. But yeah, I'm gonna get my nails shorter this time because this one is quite long and typing with long nails is not my thing anymore. Say hi to my camera. Not say hi. <laughs> this is how my nails look. Oh, it's so pretty. Good. I love it. Well, I'm getting, I'm getting my toes done and I'm so hungry. I want to get black French for my toes because I always get like either white or white French to get so I just feel like I need to do something different with it right now so that's what we're doing <sighs> I'm so tired I, well actually I don't think I'm tired I think I'm just I'm, I need to lay down you know that thing where you just feel like you should be laying down that's exactly how I feel right now I just want to relax if I even I'm going to do any work, I want to do it from my bed. I don't want to have to um, be out. I don't want to be out. And it's already 8 p.m. anyway, so. Oh my god, I look crazy. Oh, you guys, my nails. I love it so much. My nails look so pretty. But yeah, I'm in bed because I've been working. I've been working for like an hour now because it's. 10 and I got up at past 8 ish I'm just trying to work like I'm going to do double work this morning but this year one of the things that I I'm going to be open to more is taking collabs on Instagram before I actually take some but it's like pictures to get what I mean but Instagram reels I wouldn't necessarily take but that's because i don't know i'm not i'm not big on reels like that so that's why i never took those but this year i want to do a lot more work on my brand my lucy benton brand right so i want to expand it on you know the platforms that i like 
I'm still not a fan of Twitter. So I'm still not going to do any work on Twitter, to be honest, because I could... Nah, I just don't like Twitter. Twitter is not my thing. I've tried a couple times to be active on there and it's just not me. So Instagram is more like me. Instagram is a platform that I genuinely love and I genuinely love like people's content on um Instagram. And then another platform that I actually do love, but it's just I love watching other people's content not necessarily creating my content but i try sometimes it's tiktok but i want to do better at tiktok this year as well because i love tiktok like i i'm always on tiktok like every single day it's just creating my own content that's the, that's the issue that's the problem but i want to get better at it today because i want to really expand the brand i want to do work on all platforms that i genuinely love right so yeah, um, that's what I'm doing. I'm just going to spend a few hours this morning working, you know, on both like my nine to five and um, my nine to five and the editing because I also need to jump in a meet on a meeting. Oh, blah, 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 blah. what am I saying? I need to jump in a meeting. Oh, uh, not for my nine to five, but with a brand um, in I think an hour. So yeah, I'm gonna do all of that this morning headed to the mall i quickly just got up from bed and i'm headed to the mall i need to try on some shoes from steve madding i saw this cute bag at um mango and that's what i'm about to get by the way, everything that I wanted to get at the store, like the Snickers, I didn't find them. I'm a bit tired, I'm sorry if my mood. No, not okay. Not you. Uh, the card. Card. Oh, sorry. Uh, what I actually came here for, I didn't get. I didn't see. So I just want to look around. The mall is actually so full and I hate when it's full. But you guys, I just got home. I did pick up something. It was just one thing and this is an impulse buy. And it was on sale. Everywhere is on sale right now. So I have, I loved it. Well, first of all, I have this bag. The black one but this the mini so like the really small one that one is quite efficient for the size let me show you guys you guys i just realized that i haven't actually seen that purse since i moved into this place and that is concerning from mango i love it it's on sale for the chip cheap this one was also from mango was it from mango or from zara i think it was from zara this one from zara but i got this one I think last week or something like that and this bag I'm also going to take it on with me on the trip it's really efficient I love cute bags like this I love Zara and Mango for their bags but anyway I want to eat something I am starving my favorite beer since like 2020 is this beer from I can you can get it in spa or get it in Tesco it's called, oh my god, I can't pronounce it, but it's called the Greenbergen, Greenbergen. Well, I love the Rouge. They have the other one, but I don't like the other one. This one is sweet, and this is really, really good. So I'm, I'm ready and out to go. My taxi is going to be here in like three minutes. I'm running late as expected. The reason why I'm running late is justified because I recorded, you know, me getting ready for you guys. And I also like did the outfit fragrance and all of that. So I'm excused to run late, but I look good. Let me take off my shoes and like show you guys what I have on. Wait, I'm trying to turn in all the lights here so you guys can see. I think this is the brightest I can get it. Let me take this out of the way. But yeah, 
um, this is how I'm dressed. I have this coat from Zara. I have, oh, that's my taxi. I have this purse from Mango, really pretty. I have this leggings from H&M, really love. These are my favorite leggings. I have this top. I think this top is from Opoly. And then, yeah, we're good to go. My taxi is here. Jewelry, some cute stuff. Oh, 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 oh,